Brett Favre has announced he's going to return to the Minnesota Vikings for his 20th NFL season. He's 40 years old. Ken Dallafor, who's uh, he's around 40 years old, too, uh, played for the uh, Lions and the Steelers and the Chargers. He's a senior vice president with Blue Cross Blue Shield of Michigan and actually was in Minnesota yesterday when the announcement came down. Good morning to you. Hey, good morning, Michael. And uh, it was uh, exciting up in Minnesota. All the people were uh, focused on the arrival of Brett Favre. Everyone is about it then, near as you can tell. It's not like uh, Green Bay where they uh, wanted to move on to the future and got tired of his act. Uh, is is everybody pleased in Minnesota? Well, the folks I talked to up there uh, were more uh, energized around the fact he's there and the time is now for the roster that they have to, to win. And after their exciting season last year and to be one game away from the Super Bowl, they think they have to get it now. The talent's getting older, and obviously Brett Favre maybe can have another dream or magical year for him. He ended on an unpleasant note, as I recall, last year in the playoffs, uh, throwing that interception on the last gasp for Minnesota, uh, and probably doesn't want to end his career that way. Do we know anything about why he decided to come back? Uh, you know, I, I, I don't know. It's, it's kind of like speculating on why Barry Sanders retired and actually yeah. stayed retired. It's, I, I guess it's up to the individual, and you know, his is kind of uh, get through, let the training camp happen, and then get, get back into camp. I mean, he's 40. Why would you want to go to camp when you're 40? You don't want to go when you're 22. So, uh, you know, he's just sort of playing through that. But I, I think you're probably right. There's probably some to that that he didn't want to end his career on that throw in that game. Do you think that uh, the players on the team mind the fact that he skips training camp and then shows up, you know, to play a couple exhibition games and get on out there? I, I don't think so. I, I think he's such a an icon and he's had such a great career they know he knows how to do it they'd rather sort of preserve him if you will keep him on ice yeah bring him in when it counts um and, and i think all the players are smart enough to know as long as he comes in and performs like he did last year uh there's there's no uh there's no animosity there and and what about you have you decided to make a comeback at all i mean you're an awfully fit fella does it tempt you to come back into the game Michael, I'm hoping to come back and have a decent round of golf occasionally and play against you. That's, that's, my, that's what I aspire to now. Okay. Keep after it because that takes dedication. <laughs> you bet. You play at a high level. <laughs> my score is at a high level. Let's put it that way. Thank you very much for the chat this morning. Ken Dallafor from Blue Cross Blue Shield of Michigan played for the Lions, the Steelers, the Chargers, and the Michigan Panthers, and Brett Favre. We're going to see him at uh, Ford Field again this year because he's back with the Minnesota Vikings.